How to manifest anything. The only thing stopping you. From manifesting your dreams, is you. You may be familiar, with manifestation, or the laws of attraction. After all, the process was the focus, of a 2006 best-selling book, The Secret which sold, more than 30 million copies. And it's something, that our very own Novo has spoken about, but how to actually, go about manifesting something, is a different story. You control a lot, by your thoughts, and we control a lot by our joint thoughts. By what I and, we believe, Oprah told LinkedIn CEO, Jeff Weiner in 2015. When I started to figure, that out for myself, I became careful, of what I think, and what I ask for, she explained. I was like what else, can I do? What else can I manifest, because I have seen it work. I have seen it happen over, and over again. Looking to give manifestation, a try yourself? Here are the steps experts, propose you take to attempt, to manifest anything you desire, money included. Let's back up. What is manifestation exactly? Essentially, manifestation is bringing something tangible into your life through attraction and belief, that is if you think it, it will come. However, there is more to manifestation than willpower and positive thinking. Angelina Lombardo, the author of A Spiritual Entrepreneur says, Manifesting is making everything you want to feel and experience a reality. Via your thoughts, actions, beliefs, and emotions. To start manifesting, be clear about your goals. While everyone, approaches manifestation differently, Lombardo believes, most follow the same basic principles. First, you need to know, what you want. You are the only one, who dreams your dreams, so whether it's a new partner, and a healthy relationship, or a better job, know it and own it. The more clear, and concise, the better. Then, ask for what you want. Once you've pinpointed exactly, what your hopes, dreams, and goals are, you need to ask the universe, for what you want. This can be done with a vision board and, or a future box, a container full of pictures, of items you want to manifest. You can write a letter, to the universe, or speak your intentions out loud. And start working, towards your goals. While knowing what you want is half the battle, you will not see any results without action. One way to be in action when manifesting is to ask yourself the question, what would my future self be thinking? Lombardo says. The reason? Reframing your mind can, and will, enable you to be successful. Being the person, who already has, does, and feels your goals, dreams, and desires helps you, become that person. The next step, is to be mindful of, and thankful for what you receive. While you may not get everything, you envision in the order, and time frame you want, you should receive, and acknowledge, what you do get. According to Lombardo, gratitude is key. In addition to changing, your mindset, and behaviors, you will need to stay focused, and remove any obstacles, which may cloud your vision, including fear, and negative self-talk. For example, if you often, find yourself questioning your worth, or saying I don't deserve this, think of all the reasons, why you are deserving. But, be flexible. That said, the process is fluid. The steps you take, do not matter as much as your belief, so trust your actions, visions, and clarity as well as, the powers that be, Lombardo says. Faith is a powerful motivator, and guiding force. Yes, you can manifest love. The best part, about manifestation is its wide-reaching applications. The law of attraction, knows no bounds. Once you start dialing, in your manifestation process, there's no limit to what, or how often, or much you manifest, Lombardo explains. This includes new friendships, and romantic relationships. That said, it is important, to only manifest individuals who will help you fulfill your goals. You only want to attract people, who are attracted to the person, you are becoming, she says. 
Of course, this might mean the exclusion of a few exciting prospects, but I'm sure you'd agree that you'll be happier with someone who's aligned with the you that's making big moves. Same goes for money. The process for manifesting money follows the same steps previously mentioned. However, Marla McKenna, the author of Manifesting Your Dreams, emphasizes that financial manifestation is rooted in gratitude well and working. The trick for manifesting money is looking at the abundance you already have and expressing gratitude for it, McKenna says. So even if you are struggling to pay bills, raise your vibration and block any limiting beliefs by welcoming the money and prosperity that is on the way. In short, focus on what you have, not what you don't have. McKenna also suggests using visual tools to keep you driven and focused. Buy a bigger purse, visualize swimming in a pool of cash, make a money tree of monopoly money until you can replace it with real money or write a large check to yourself. Knowing that one day you will indeed cash it. What's the fastest way to manifest something? If you see it and feel it, you will achieve it, at least according to McKenna. The easiest way to manifest anything is to be clear about what you want. Don't give the universe mixed signals and take action. Working toward your goals is imperative. You should also remain receptive. Ask the God for what you want and keep an eye out for signs of achievement or success. The only thing stopping you from manifesting your dreams is you, McKenna says. What you can visualize in your mind, you can hold in your hands. So get to work, you have manifesting to do. Thank you for watching our video. Please like and subscribe.